Mom, I'm on camera. I'm on TV. I'm going viral. Not really. There's a random dude on Twitter that's noticed my re-zero grind. 363 likes though, not bad. 10.7k views and they say, what the fuck? Bro has dropped 70 videos on ReZero in two weeks from now, and that's insane. And you know what the funniest part is? We're on episode 18 right now. We're not even on season two. And by the time we get to season two, there's even more content we can farm with any news cut content. Right now, we're actually nerfed, right? Right now, we're nerfed because any news didn't even have cut content for the rest of the episodes after episode five and six. Not only that, once I finish season one, I can farm even more video essays talking about ReZero season one before season two happens. And once I finish season two, then I can actually farm every video essay, every if route. There, like, it's just the beginning. Like, you have no idea the amount of ReZero that you will be fed. Let's see some of the comments. I don't care if he's milking. As long as he's glazing, that's okay. That's amazing. Keep cooking. You can kick. You can cook, brother. I love this Toto. Is he a good reactor? Might check him if out he is. Mm. That is a subjective thing. Who am I to say that I'm the best? At the end of the day, the audience will simply see the product and the content will speak for itself. I mean, reaction content is really low effort and doesn't require that much work. So, I mean, he's not wrong, right? All I do is just fucking record a video. There's little to no editing except the actual episode reaction. But lower for content does not correlate to low entertainment. Lower for content can be very entertaining. This guy is just mad that I'm obviously making a living off of doing lower for content. But hey, you can do it too, bro. Just turn the fucking webcam on and just react to anime. It's easy. We can trust him, says Sin Archbishop of Insane Madness. Currently, he's on episode uh, ReZero Season 1, Episode 18, and he's farming ReZero Break Time episode. Chibi reviews. My own analysis. Now that I'm farming the drama, there's even a waifu wars going on right now, bro. Straight up. Look, I am about to unleash another level of fucking content with this fucking meme. We've already farmed all the comments here, and when the video of Episode 18 goes out, right? Oh my god. God, it's gonna get volatile. So many Rem Glazers, so many Amelia Glazers, so many Subaru Glazers, and I will be there. I will be there to farm it. Professional farmer, you're goddamn right. Holy bros milking ReZero. I'm not milking, I am pumping, bro. I am gonna get everything out of it. And you know what? The funniest thing about this is that from the beginning, from the absolute beginning. Is it in this playlist where I explain why I didn't react to ReZero? No, I should probably add it, right? I literally have why, why I did not react to ReZero, right? The reason I didn't react to ReZero, I give you an analytical analysis about it's stupid to react to ReZero before, but better when I'm obviously growing more as a channel, right? From the beginning, I went in. Oh, oh this is mad loud of culture, by the way. Apparently, also. Oh, Random, random, <laughs> random drama. He started this shit. I've already made a separate video and drama video, right? I've already made a separate drama video, which is almost already getting like, what is this? Hold up, we're, we're, we're getting off tangent here. I, I just want to flex for a bit. This motherfucker, I live rent free in his head. He got jealous and he called me out on bullshit, fake news. And then I created a drama video to fucking crucify him. And where is the video? Where I think it's hitting like 11, 12k right this one over here. Fraud lad of scams exposed and buying subs of views. Go check the video out if you want to know why he blocked me, why he blocks other successful reaction channels like Freshest Anime before even interacting. He's an insecure little pathetic boy. And I want you to, sh I, I, I also want you to know this part. Yeah, 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 yeah. So in the video, I talked about how he buys his subs and views. Let me just do a quick summary. So right now, this is the sub spiking, even though the views are not changing. He recently just got 1,200 subscribers. He swiped his credit card. If you look at this, averaging 2,000 subs per one month at 200K views. And I want you to understand that the 200K views are coming from his short videos, which is easy views, but no money without long form content because no one actually watches him because he doesn't actually have a community. And then I want you to look at my number. I want you to realize that I'm also averaging 2.K uh, subs per month, but getting 1.3 mil. This is the actual number that it takes to get this kind of number, right? 
Look at this shit. You're gonna actually tell me that you're literally less than a tenth of me and you think, nah, nah, nah. You're just trying to make this fucking post right now, right? This is what he's trying to do. You know what's funny? You know what's funny? He's trying to get to that 50K mark so that he can do this. Are you ready for this shit? I'll show you the saddest thing ever. I will show you the saddest thing ever. Like, no shame. Just like the most shameless person is... Oh, Jesus Christ, he's fucking spamming shorts right now, post right now. Where the fuck is this post? It has to do with a 40k sub post. There's a, there's a post he made saying, oh my god, thank you so much for the 40k subs. I, I thank all my fucking mad ladders. Where, where is this? Come on. Sorry, guys. Hold on. Let me cook. Let me cook. I'm cooking. I'm cook. Oh, here it is. You telling me that a guy with almost 40k subs, you make a post saying, today we hit a milestone. You, you telling me that this dude that hit a fucking milestone for 40k subs got two comments and 22 likes. No, bro. It's a channel of bots. People don't watch this guy. He just buys his... Anyways, we're, we're getting off topic. We're, let's, let's, let's get back to the reason we're glazing. Let's get back to the reason we're glazing right now. But there's a good reason why this is happening, okay? And remember, he started this shit. I did not remember. And this is on Christmas Eve Eve. I want you to realize this. Christmas Eve Eve... He tried to shit on me, trying to cause drama. I didn't start this, he did. Okay, remember that? Back to this. Holy bros making yes. Her season three is coming. Make sure he get the bag one way or the other. Exactly. Season three is coming. I prepared in advance to farm one episode every day into season three. Farmer, absolutely. Let that man farm. His analysis are very in-depth, mad respect. Thank you, see the Reaper. I mean, he did say he was gonna farm it. Chris Strategy, I guess, of course I did. At least his analysis are really good. You can tell he's involved. But like comments like this is so cringe. I appreciate the glaze of my analysis. But notice how he starts the sentence by at least. There is this prejudice and bias and hate towards reaction content because of how low effort content it is, but how much money you can make doing it. Just remember that there is this unrecognized subconscious that people have where they don't even know why they type like this. His videos are actually good, whatever. Remember, at the end of the day, I don't have to say my shit's good. The product will simply speak for itself. I'm watching his content. He comments a lot more bit different than others. No, I comment a lot more. He knows what peak is. Reaser honestly is fucking peak. Wow, time to waste my evening. Hey, enjoy the playlist. Yeah, I watch his reaction, uh-huh. I only watch his reaction to the actual episodes and those are a peak. Finally, another reactor that truly pays attention. You're goddamn right. He on that grind, of course. He been converted? No. You think... He, he, here's the thing that people don't get. Right now, ReZero is getting the attention that it deserves. But I am not a ReZero channel. I'm a reaction commentary channel. You think that I'm on the side of ReZero? No. I'm on the side of money. I'm on the side of getting the bag. If it means farming ReZero for what it's got, of course I'm gonna do it. Do I have loyalty to ReZero specifically? No. I'm gonna watch many other shit and farm that too. But at the end of the day, because of how passionate and how good the analysis can be, people will recognize the product. Even if I am a cheap slut going around series to series, Farming everything it has. I have no loyalty. Uh, my only loyalty is with money. Milking? You're goddamn right. The bills can't be this high. Oh, you'd be surprised how much it fucking costs to live in Vancouver, bro. Damn. Just the- Hey, there's Frazier right over here. Respecting him for trying to consume all the content. Few reactors care enough about a series to do that. You're goddamn right. There's a lot of reactors that sees this as a cheap hustle. All they have to do is fucking sit there, watch the episode, say, Wow. That's crazy. So interesting. No way. And people still click onto those videos. It's fucking pathetic. Peak Farmer, you right. Yeah, I watch him. You right. The brain run as well and truly said it. Oh, it's going to get more run. Yeah, he literally said he's milking the content. But it's fine since he utterly humbling roasting all the brain dead Mushoku Glazers live in the comments. Oh, boy. Another comment. Rent free Rudy's living. Bro, Mushoku Tensei. <laughs> and Rudy just keeps caught catching straight fucking bullets. It's funny. I support farmers, and that's pretty much it. Another instance where the people have recognized the content. At the end of the day, I don't have to say my shit's good. People will simply watch the content and say that it's good. I am not the star. I don't want to be the star. People will simply let it, you know, shine the light on me. But some people, some people like this, bro. Oh, oh. Pfft. Tell me that this graph makes sense to you, bro.
watch the drama video and tell me this graph makes sense to you, bro.